Lee, ultimately a, a narrow defeat for your team tonight. What's the overriding feeling in your dressing room? Uh, frustration, disappointing for the players. Thought they were well worth a, at least a point. I thought the general performance was of a high standard. Some really impressive individual performances. So I was pleased with that aspect. Um, so disappointed for the players, really. There didn't look to be any kind of confidence issues when they came out. From minute one, they were right at it, weren't they? Yeah, we made a conscious effort um, to give some players an opportunity to, uh, um, you know, give some players their head, looking one eye on the future. And because we have to do that, we have to be realists. We've got to keep fighting. While we're still mathematically in there, we've got to keep fighting, but with each game that passes. So I've got to have a structure in place and, and, and look at people and give people opportunities who maybe thought, hadn't had them previously from now at the end of the season to, um, to, to stake a claim to be part of uh, the rebuilding job that I'll be doing over the course of the summer months. Obviously, frustration at the result aside, it must be really pleasing that those individuals have stuck their hand up and, and given you a reason to, to pick them again. Of course. I said to the players before the game, you know, it's not just uh, your future at Blackpool, it's it's potentially the future of your careers, your family's you know, future as well, because, you know, the, the lads who've got an opportunity to, to have great rewards. So every game they've got from now to the end of the season, can they put on their best performances? And whether their future is at Blackpool or not, to get the best opportunities for them come the summer, um, and and that's the way we, we delivered it. The players have delivered that, uh, a, a real good performance, one of our best for a long, long time, and uh, unfortunately, once little errors cost us cost us the game because we haven't really let Birmingham in behind us at any opportunity. Young Demory Gray, who's got frightening pace, and Clayton Donaldson, we didn't give them much room to manoeuvre tonight.